Hey guys, what's up? It's Jerome and it is Friday, which means I'm back with another video. You can probably already guess what this video is about just from the title, so let's go ahead and just skip the chit chat and get right into it. How much money do engineers make? A lot. See you guys next week. Just kidding. But really though, engineers have the potential to make a lot of money over the course of their careers and even straight out of college. But how much money you make is gonna depend on a couple of different things what kind of engineer you are, where you live, and what industry you're gonna be working in. For example, if you're a mechanical engineer and you're working in the automotive industry, you're probably gonna make more money if you live in Michigan versus if you live in a small town in Tennessee. Or if you're a software engineer and you're working in Silicon Valley, you're probably gonna make more money than someone living in North Dakota that's also a software engineer. But on the flip side of that, there are companies that will pay you a little extra money if you're living in like an undesirable place and they just wanna keep you around. So without further ado, let's look at some of the most popular engineering majors and see how much money they make coming right out of college. So first, let's look at civil engineers. Civil engineers are gonna start out making on average about $56,000 a year. Civil engineers are typically gonna be working on projects that deal with designing and building highways, airports, bridges, dams, things like that, that you would expect to have a lot of structural integrity. Maybe that's a word. So a lot of that kind of work is gonna be design work that you would do behind a desk, but these engineers are also gonna spend a lot of time out in the field working with construction forces and just making sure construction is going correctly. The next group of engineers we're gonna look at are biomedical engineers. So biomedical engineers are typically gonna work on designing medical devices and equipment, maybe a lot of robotics or prosthetics type work. So they're gonna be working in hospitals, doing research at universities, or maybe for like a biotech firm. And typically they're gonna be making about $60,000 a year right out of college. The next one we're gonna look at are mechanical engineers. So what exactly do mechanical engineers do? Well, this one's really easy to think about because this is what everyone thinks of when they think engineer. They're basically everywhere. Think about the automotive industry. They're gonna be designing cars or maybe designing the machines that make the cars. Think of the aerospace industry. They might be designing the planes. Um, basically, a mechanical engineer can do anything that requires, I don't know, mechanics. And mechanical engineers are gonna start off making about $61,000 a year right out of college. Next on the list, my personal favorite, electrical engineers. So what does an electrical engineer do? Well, we work with electricity. An electrical engineer is basically gonna work with anything that's got wires, sensors, maybe sometimes a little bit of software. And just like mechanical engineers, you're gonna find electrical engineers basically everywhere because nowadays you need electricity to run anything. So any sort of manufacturing plant, you're gonna need an electrical engineer, any sort of power plant, anywhere really. And electrical engineers are gonna start off making a little bit more right out of college at an average of $64,000 a year. Moving on, let's talk about chemical engineers. Chemical engineers are gonna be working on chemicals as you would expect. Usually they're not gonna be actually designing or creating new chemicals. It's usually more about the process of producing a chemical. So for example, if you work at a chemical plant, then a chemical engineer might take what you do in a laboratory environment on a small scale and figure out how to scale that up a hundred times so then you can produce tons and tons of whatever chemical it is you're trying to produce. And sticking to the trend, chemical engineers are gonna be making a little bit more at $66,000 a year right out of college. And the highest earning right now out of college, the computer engineer. Computer engineers are gonna have a lot of similarities with electrical engineers, but the main difference being that they focus a lot more on software as opposed to hardware that an electrical engineer would focus on. Now in today's world where everything is software driven, these guys make the most amount of money because everything's going towards software and yeah, there's just a lot more opportunity in that space right now. So computer engineers start off making on average $71,000 a year. 
Now, again, a lot of these statistics are gonna change based on where you live, what industry you work in, what company you work for, whether or not they give you a yearly bonus or how good their 401k matching program is. All that stuff's gonna be taken into consideration when giving you your actual starting salary. And of course, as you move up the ladder, you're just gonna make more and more money with yearly raises and things like that. Plus, if your company gives you the opportunity to work overtime, then you could potentially work 60 hours a week and get paid time and a half for the extra 20 that you put in. Now we're at the part of the video that you guys have been waiting on. How much money did I make as an electrical engineer? So I worked as an electrical engineer for the last two years before I decided to quit. And how much money did I make? Well, I worked in the chemical industry, and in my opinion, my company was paying us a little bit of a premium for living in the location that we did. It was a very small town, so I think the incentive there was pay a higher starting salary to convince you to stay in that area. Also, they had a higher starting salary, but the yearly bonuses were a little less, and so there's a trade-off to that. Maybe other companies would prefer to give you a lower starting salary and give you a yearly bonus that is more reflective of your work over the course of that year. So back to the main question, how much money did I make as an electrical engineer? My starting salary right out of school was, I don't know what happened to my camera there. I think, I think it cut out. I'm not, did you catch that though? Just kidding, I'll tell you. My starting salary right out of school was $77,200. And after working there for about two years and getting raises and things like that, I was making just under 85,000 before I quit, which now I'm wondering, I forget, why did I, why did I do that? Oops. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed that video and it was informative and you learned some things about money. I think I have the luxury of talking about my ex-salary now that I'm back in school and I'm not actually working anymore, so that's kind of cool. Anyways, if you guys like this video, please hit the thumbs up down below, subscribe to the channel, and share this video with your friends. Share it if they want to get into engineering, share it if they don't want to get into engineering. I don't know. Just share it with people, please. That's all for this week, guys. I'll catch you guys next week. Peace.